Alpha. Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Climb here, and uh, thanks for joining me on a gameplay breakdown. So it's been a while since I've done one of these. Not only just a video, but a, a, a breakdown. So this was just recently. I'm still visiting family. I hope you've had a wonderful Christmas and the New Year's coming up. Pretty excited about this. So I'm gonna get into the gameplay, and I did a terrible push. A little unlucky, but I did a terrible push. And through the magic of editing, I'm gonna fast forward a little bit back to the action because I died like a dummy. <clears throat> so when I come back up towards B, I just want to snipe down. I know at least one guy's down. Terrible snipes. Panicking. At least they backed up. You still see I panicked um, on that second shot. Backed up, got that... Once they backed up, I got that headshot. My teammate pushed in, which was great. Fast forward a little bit because it is boring and nothing. So I know that I'm re-engaged because my teammate's back up top, right? So we're um, maybe from reinforcing principles that you've seen earlier uh, from my videos. You just want to stay with, stick with your team. I was super unlucky. I thought I'd <laughs> I do dead to rights, but uh, super unlucky I got that shotgun kill. I know my, my teammate's down. I see someone on the radar. I'm trying to utilize the cover as best I can, so check out that tips video where I've uh, talked about cover a little bit. And so I know this guy's coming around. I hear him. I explode the, uh, the box, which was great because I got enough damage where I could two-shot him. And I thought that I had this guy, but um, of course he just gets a body shot on me, which is too bad, but that's okay. So we're gonna get back into the action. Um, I get a little, little discombobulated here. See a lot of, a lot of red, a lot of radar. So I just want to book it out. I just want to reposition. I don't want to be pinched. Chuck a grenade preemptively. Check out the tips video where I've talked about leading with grenades. Um, Pre-aiming. Just want to make sure I get the first shot off. I do. I know this guy's gonna push in. He knows I'm weak. I don't have a shotgun, but what I can do is still float over. Um, try to get him in the headshot, or at least any sort of body shot, and then melee him, because I knew he was going to rush in with something um, at he below head height. So I, le I knew I had the, the advantage there. Um, lead with the grenade. Now this guy's going to die. I'm going to get a little speed boost, uh, reload a little faster, and then just panic shooting a little bit, shooting a little fast, but that's okay. Get this guy down. Someone's popping up behind me. want to reposition. Um, so when he's going up above me, I don't want to aim down sights anymore. I'm just going to shoot down... Um, from my hips because I can fire maybe a little bit more quickly a little more accurately uh, than from um, from aiming down sights so here I'm trying to utilize cover again I uh, get one nice headshot which is great um, trying to help cover that orb a little bit with my teammate here <clears throat> just chucking a grenade and then this is nothing important I'm just getting special kind of reloading uh, and so when I reposition I'm gonna head back up top towards B uh, know where my teammates down and again, I've got at least one grenade up. He's in a tight corridor, so he's probably most likely going to get damaged. Gets just enough damage. And I start panic shooting a little bit, right? But I don't want to re-engage. I know he's weak. He knows I'm weak. I don't want to re-engage. I see two people on the radar now. So I'm going to back off, see if I can get a different angle, and utilize that cover, right? It's all about survivability, utilizing that cover. Um, if when you do that, you know, you're descoping and unscoping. That saved my life because I saw that quick blip. I was able to let me back up, um, get some shots in the air on him, and that was the only reason why I survived. This is just a quick little pick, nothing exciting. Uh, but make sure if you're trying not to hard scope too much, you know, some basic stuff, but that's okay. Uh, just don't hard scope, come back in and out from your, uh, from your snipe, and then you can get a little lucky there. So now we're doing pretty well. We're starting to, starting to make some progress. Um, I was gonna try to just force this guy out of his bubble. Uh, got my teammate. Or my teammate got him. There's another guy in there. And especially for threes with Sunbreaker, um, I like running Sun Charge uh, because you can take down a, uh, a super in case they have a super. And then uh, it's just kind of help quickly close the gap. All right, so now I'm going to reposition. Um, I thought my teammates were up here. I made a bad choice, but I'm going to get a little lucky and getting, you know, just running the frick away. Just do not engage, right? But it was a great. Um, escape so part of that escape was not just running in a straight line you see me utilizing the cover backing Every in and out I mean thankfully he didn't chase me and he went down the main alley uh, this is nothing exciting just getting some heavy revives and uh, I'm gonna reposition uh, after I get some special reposition back up on top of uh, B so I get a lot of missed shots like yeah, I know he's weak I just get like the luckiest grenade ever right I'm damaged I get my health back a little bit and I also disengaged. No, I didn't know the second guy was there, but I disengaged just because I didn't want to waste shots. See, this dude the sun break, and I'm like, I'm out. Um, but I figured after this kill with my teammate, he's he would have been out. And I know I stalled heavy, so I wanted to re-engage. Now, unfortunately, there was two guys here, right? And of course, the second guy had rockets. Um, so nothing too exciting, but at least I got a kill. Um, 
So here I'm just with my teammate, right? So one of my guys left. It's just a two on three skirmish now. Um, I throw a grenade on the left and I re-engage on the right. Uh, I knew my teammate, if you're paying attention, my teammate was helping engage with that guy going forward to my right. So because I knew he was going to at least go after him and his attention was on, on this guy that I'm looking at right now, I want to turn my attention to the left. I want to cover our flank. And thankfully I did uh, to see that guy next to me and that's how I was able to get that... Um, just kind of that, that spatial awareness, that radar awareness. Just making sure that like, you know, my teammates going in, I want to try to cover our flank. So again, narrow corridor, lead with their grenade. He would have died anyway, but at least I got him killed a little bit quicker. And you can see the score, like we're just, we're just killing it. So now we're just trying to stick, like I wanted to stay up a little bit, uh, stay up top a little bit, but I noticed my teammate was charging in. So I want to be a good team player, charging with him. Um, he dies, so I back off to see if his res comes up behind me. Radar pops up, I have a grenade, I chuck it preemptively, <coughs> and worked out swimmingly. Uh, nothing too exciting there, just double body shot. I'm wanting to guard this red res because I know when they're coming up uh, from the mid, and I get two sexy headshots. I was feeling pretty good about that. Obviously my teammate was too, a nice little dance. Um, just throwing a grenade to lead, get a little damage on him, teammate cleans him up. We have one more kill to win, and so I've got my Sunbreaker, I leave, as soon as I see someone on the radar, just gonna pop it charge in teammate gets one guy down i get the other and that's it uh so nothing um i just thought it was a great gameplay i mean i went 24 and 4 6 kd uh, just absolutely destroyed especially on a 2v3 for the latter half but hope you enjoyed quick breakdown and i uh, hope you enjoy some of my other uh videos as well cheers guys